Hey, what is going on, Internet? My name is The Great Magnet, and today I am bringing you guys another moveset Mondays, considering that it is, in fact, Monday. Now, as for today's moveset, well, all right, let me back, let me backtrack for a second. Now, I know last week's moveset wasn't really the most sort of innovative, as some of you guys might have said. I mean, I, I hope you didn't unsubscribe. Uh, but yeah, um, I, I, know, I know it really wasn't the most, like, revolutionary thing. I'm pretty, yeah, like I said, I'm, I know it was done before. I just wanted to share it with you guys. But, um, to make fun, make up for it, um, uh, we got something a little bit more custom today, and as you can see, we have ourselves a Blastoise, and what do you know, we got an Assault Vest on this guy, so, it's gonna be a similar thing to the Torkoal, in case you didn't see the first, the very first moveset Monday, yeah, we got an AV Spinner right here, so, yeah, with that Rapid Spin to spin away all the hazards, Scald, in order to, well, get that nice stab and burn stuff, and to it KO Town Flames, because you really don't have any special attack investment, Ice Beam, so you can just handle those Lander's T, um, those guard chomps that like to be running around in OU, uh, Salamences, all that, all that lovey dovey stuff, and then you have Mirror Coat. Now, in case you don't know what Mirror Coat is, um, you basically take a special hit and bounce it back at double the damage for whatever was hit with you at, and paired the Assault Vest. It's actually really good because it's still considered as an attack and move, attacking move, so it's basically like the special form of counter, so. Then as for the nature, we have Calm to boost up that special defense, and then we have Torrent as our ability, because if you do get brought down into, say, like, the yellow-ish, like, below 33%, say, like, a Talonflame Choice Banded uh, Brave Bird, you might get brought down to that zone to where you can just completely Oko it with a Scald, and you would be all good from there. So yeah, looking at stats, as you can tell, we definitely invested not so much into special defense because we are going to be having the assault vest. So with the special defense, 302 times 1.5 would be about um let's say let's say uh, 450 like 453 I'd like to say yeah 453 as your special defense, which is really good. Um. Then we have uh, 152 in the defense, just to kind of take those physical hits just a little bit better if you need to after hazard and whatnot, because you are going to be coming here to spin away some hazards at some points, maybe come in, um, maybe d dish out some double damage back from like special attackers, because you can just take their hits all day. Um, so yeah, with that said, like that kind of sums up like the basics for like your spread and stuff. And as you can see, we got the nice little picture of the Blastoise and stuff too, because visuals are all, they're, they're always nice to have. So what also did this time, I know that you guys, some of you guys out there, want some calx. I know I, I asked some people for some input on them, like like other people who do like move set vids. Um, and, and the guy said he's like, yo, dude, you need some calculations on this stuff. And you know what? I, I decided we're gonna get some calculations. So I'm just gonna pop those up really quick because you guys have a pace bin you can go to in the description below. But as for me, I'm just gonna be looking at the pace bin directly. So yeah, let me read a couple of these off in freaking advertisements showing up on the paper. Um, so yeah, I'll just read off some main calcs. Um, so if you're in UU, you have like 252 special attack makeup nectar thunderbolt versus uh, your spread assault vest blast toys would be a 13.3% to it KOs. So after that, you use some of your health and you can just use that mirror coat. You can just come in, take whatever it because they don't expect you to be able to live. They're freaking Thunderbolt. Because you shouldn't. You really shouldn't. So, and they don't expect the Mirror Coat either. So, you can come in a lot of special attackers. Zapdos is Thunderbolt. Like 252 special attack if you're running that. Uh, that's a guaranteed 3 at KO. Um, 252 special attack. Mega Charizard Y. Solar Beam versus Mega Blastoise is a 14.1 chance to 2 at KO. So, that is freaking amazing. And then don't even get me started on defensive Rotom, man. Four, like, four, special four special attack, whatever, versus your spread is a 76.3% chance to 4 hit KO. So, you have a potential chance to get 5 hit KO'd by this thing. But like I said, hazards are a thing. So, these little chances or whatever... They are going to get diminished by hazards that you would be intending to spin away. So, yeah, just going down the list, 252 Special Attack, Mold Breaker, Mega Ampharos, Thunderbolt versus your typical Assault voice, assault Vest Blastoise spread is a guarantee to it KO, going around like 56-ish percent minimum, 66 percent maximum. Psy Shock from uh, Alakazam is a 90 percent chance to 3 hit KO, that is kind of why we did the whole little spread thing with the defense, because we want to be able to take those hits a little bit better. Um, so yeah, from this point on, uh, um, last point I guess would be Choice Specs, Latios, Straco, Meteor versus the Blastoise spread would be a 53.1 chance of 2 hit KO. So you definitely have, you have a chance to get 3 hit KO'd by this, 
So, yeah. Um, and so, like I said, this gets paired up very nicely with Mirror Code because being able to take these hits a little bit not so well is good because you can come in on this and they don't expect you to take the hit. And you can just mirror coat that thing in oblivion. So make sure to go check out the paste bin for some other calcs. Um, I left some other decent ones in there too. So yeah, definitely make sure to check that out if you're into whole calcs and stuff. So yeah, some good teammates I guess would be stuff like stuff. Um, hazards are another good thing because your ice beam does not always OCO because you have no special attack investment. So rocks, spikes, the works, um, it, it, maybe an extra spinner in case you need to use more of the mirror coat than the rapid spin. I'd say like fortress if you're going for UU. Fortress would definitely be nice as you can switch in on the fire type attacks it does not want to take. So yeah, I'm definitely trying to think. Just stuff that definitely carries some good synergy with it. Stuff you can switch in and out of. Um, I know that's basically the same thing for any team, but... Yeah, that sums up in about right. Um, so yeah, make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed this little more in-depth, I guess you could say, for a uh, thing. Let me know in the comments how I did, um, any things that you might want me to change, add on, improve. Uh, let me know how you think I did on the calcs, because like I said, this is my first time, and if you wanna, are one of those people who recommended that to me, uh, definitely make sure to give me some feedback, because that would be very appreciated. So yeah, guys, make sure to stay tuned, because I have a really special thing planned for later in the week. You guys are going to see some you've already known. Uh, but yeah, like I said, uh, make sure to stick around for an upload later in the week. And until then, guys, I am the Crit Magnet, and I am signing off.